Welcome to training on the DAC Score app. In this video, we will review how to set up and run a game using DAC Score for basketball. Here are the different app locations, so you will want to download this before getting started and ensure the MX1 is installed and powered on at the scoreboard. For this training, we will be using an Apple iPhone and will be using the demo mode within the app. First, open the app by clicking on it and you will see it automatically search for an MX1 device. Once locating the device, select it and it will show connecting, connected, and lastly, retrieving configuration before launching the application interface. Note that the DAC Score app does use Bluetooth Low Energy, or BLE, to communicate with the AllSport MX1. Here is an example of the signal flow for both the wired and the radio communication. By selecting the main menu button, indicated as three lines on the upper left corner, you can either select a new game, settings, disconnect, or turn on the scoreboard. Let's take a look at the settings to make sure we have it set up for the correct sport. Here, you can select the sport using the drop-down. Change the scoreboard name by selecting the box and typing in the name you choose. Change brightness. Select the radio broadcast and channel settings to match the MX1 if using the wireless option. And set team name message center display size if your scoreboard has electronic team name. You may also access diagnostics when connected to the scoreboard or click the link provided to automatically be routed to Dactronic's support site for additional knowledge. Once selecting the correct sport and making the appropriate changes to the settings, select Done, and you will then see the setup for that specific sport. Here, we are using basketball, so let's see how we can control the board. Use the up and down arrows to adjust the team scores and use the plus and minus buttons to change the period. Tap the possession and bonus arrows to illuminate the appropriate indicators on the scoreboard throughout the game. If you would like to expose the team fouls function, tap more and then tap the up and down arrows to adjust the team fouls. If you have a team name message center, you can personalize the home guest by selecting the settings button next to the team names. Both sides will be completed the same way. Next, we have the clock. By clicking the clock settings button, you get options to reset the clock, edit the clock, or edit the period. You can also press the play button to the left of the clock to start and stop the clock throughout the game. Please make note that electronic captions are not compatible at this time. This completes the operation of DAC score for basketball. Thanks for watching, and if you would like additional information, please see dactronics.com support and or the product reference page.